And with President Biden exiting this race, Democratic delegates now faced with one less option to choose on the November ballot. 7 News Detroit reporter Darren Cunningham speaking with two local delegates weighing in on the next steps. Wayne County Commissioner Jonathan Kinlock is a delegate for the Michigan Democratic Party, meaning he's tasked with casting a vote for the party's presidential nominee in Chicago next month at the 2024 Democratic National Convention. As a delegate, how does this past weekend shake things up for you heading into the convention? Well, it, 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 it changes who we're going to be supporting uh, right now. Uh, I know myself and many other leaders in the Democratic Party and among the congressional delegation have uh, placed our support behind our Vice President Kamala Harris. And so uh, now we have to pretty much rally folks to support the same uh, same path, path towards uh, the nomination. While he's certain of his pick, he notes this is uncharted territory. We're still waiting to hear from the uh, from the party, from the DNC specifically, as relates to what's next steps. Because you do recall that there were some conversations around doing an early sort of endorsement for President Biden. Is that, I'm getting questions regarding that, is that still the case? Um, will there be a virtual nomination, I mean a virtual uh, nomination for uh, the vice president? So, uh, or we will just have an open convention in uh, next month. But we do have a responsibility, I think, as delegates to make sure that we're picking the ticket that will give us the strongest chance to beat Donald Trump in November. Oakland County Executive Dave Coulter is also a delegate who is also placing his support behind Kamala Harris as the Democratic Party navigates uncharted territory. I think a lot of that uncertainty in Michigan went away when the governor came out in a, in a strong defense of Kamala and strong endorsement. She is the de facto leader of the Democratic Party in Michigan. So I think that carries a lot of weight. So I think the uncertainty around our presidential nominee is done. Coulter says he thinks the uncertainty now centers on who will be Harris's pick for vice presidential nominee, but neither he nor Kinlock say that influences their pick of Harris as the presidential nominee. Darren Cunningham, 7 News Detroit. Darren, thank you.